Okay, today is a not yet another Monday, Motivational Monday. Hey, you guys. Some of the times I feel like these talks get really serious and really boring. So we're going to play a fun game. We are going to try and guess what Carly is doing, and then we're going to eliminate that out of our lives, okay? Because we all do this. So if you guys are smart, you will understand what I'm doing. Ready? Um, what do you think these are called? Hurry, tweet at me. I want you, I want to know. What am I doing right now? I hope you can read this. It's not backwards. It probably is. <sighs> okay, you know what these are? These are excuses. I'm too tired to do this today. I don't have a money enough money to be to pay my bills, to be successful, to get the things that I want. I don't have enough time. I'm running out of time. I'm too scared. If I do it and I don't succeed or I feel uncomfortable, I'm not going to do well at it. I don't have the right equipment. This is more so for me and YouTube. So this is what we're doing. We are making a list of all of our excuses. We're going to highlight them. We're going to point them out. We're going to give them some attention. And then you know what we're going to do? We are going to come up with reasons why we are not too tired. And we're going to cross off all the excuses that we could ever possibly have. Because that's what's going to help us feel freed from weighing us down of not feeling the motivation or the inspiration or the desire to get up day to day and do the things that we want because too often our whiteboards are filled with these excuses and things that are holding us back or making us feel a certain way that just isn't going to help us be successful. So this is my challenge to you, Monday motivation. A lot of you tweeted at me, how do you stay motivated? How are you, how do you stay inspired? Let's talk about getting rid of excuses or eating healthier Whatever it is, you just need to write down all your excuses that you have because guess what? Excuses are like butts. Everybody has them and sometimes they're stinky and nobody likes a stinky butt. So let's get rid of it. Let's wash it clean. So I want you guys to get in your journal. You can tweet them at me, put it on your Instagram, wherever you need to be held accountable, write them on your mirror. I want you to highlight your excuses. What are your excuses? What's holding you back from doing the things you want? Is it losing weight? Is it going back to school? Is it becoming a better parent, spouse? Whatever it is, I have a million lists of things I want to do and to become better at, but I also have a lot of excuses that I give myself, and too often these become a crutch and we lean on them, and that can become really dangerous because that holds us back from getting the things in our lives that we really want and desire and, most importantly, that we deserve. So my motivation to you guys this Monday, make a list of all your excuses and then go through and pick them apart very finely and say, how am I going to get more money? Instead of looking at it as a negative thing, flip the table and look at it in a new light. How am I going to find more money to be able to go back to school or to go to the gym or to buy that dress to go on that date that I'm afraid of? Or how am I going to get out of my unc in my comfort zone and just really push myself to trying new things or being open? So that, and then I promise you, once you start seeing pathways out of the things that are holding you back, you're going to see new pathways to being successful and achieving the things that you want, you need, you desire, you deserve. Need, desire, deserve. That is the lesson for today. So go get your lists. I want to see them. I want you to hold yourself accountable. Leave it in the comments below if that's what you need to do. But today we are getting rid of our stinky butts. No more excuses. We're going to free ourselves from them and find new ways to be successful and to, to, to push ourselves and stay motivated. So happy Monday motivation. That is my challenge and desire for all of you that you will find the things in your life that you deserve and clear out the cobwebs because I promise you look at it as this way. It's like a little spring cleaning for the mental, the emotional, and the spiritual. And tomorrow, look at these seventh grade nails. I feel like I call them seventh grade nails because oh, this is what my nails look like all the time in seventh grade. I was bad at painting or I'd get too caught up or ADD and I would stop painting them so then they would look like this. We are going to be doing a tutorial on a whole new nail color and um, a gel nail 
equipment that I purchased that I'm pretty impressed with. So tomorrow's going to be Valentine's Nails, dedicated for Valentine's Nails. Wednesday is going to be a vlog of Steve and I and some exciting news we have for you guys. Thursday is going to be kind of this look for Valentine's makeup, a little different. But you're going to be getting a Thursday tutorial on makeup, Tip Thursday. And then of course Friday we're going to be rocking some Fitness Friday. We're going to be doing some all arm workout. It's gonna Your arms are going to feel like limp wieners by the time you're done with it. So welcome to the week. I'm excited you guys are here. Get rid of your excuses today. It's my challenge for you. I love you. I love your butts, not your stinky ones. So get rid of them.